Well, less than two months and a half after its devastating tornado, much of Jimmy Davis State Park is repaired and reopened, and it's just in time for the 4th of July. Fox 14's Maya Hudgens is back from celebrating with some of the community. Maya? Sarah, today, Jimmy Davis Park was far from empty. It was filled with people, laughter, and the smell of grilled hot dogs. To some, this might seem like any other 4th of July celebration, but with major damage from a tornado. I was sad to hear that it happened to somewhere that we've been so many times. Didn't think that it would actually happen somewhere here, but it does. It just goes to show that it can happen to anyone, but we got to pull through it. But that hasn't kept these families away from their favorite things the park has to offer. Because it's fun with water, and I love the water. I like how we get to spend time with our family together, so. The community was excited to come out and celebrate despite only some of the park being in operation. It just keeps getting more and more people regardless of the damage. It's, everyone still loves it. We come out still. And for some, this tradition will continue. This is where we always come for July the 4th. And we were so excited when we looked on the internet and saw that it would be open. Thanks to support from park staff and offices in Baton Rouge, visitors say they are happy that fixing the park in time for celebrating our country's heroes was a top priority. We're really excited that they pushed as hard as they did to get it open for everyone to come out and have fun. As of earlier today, there had been over 1,100 people that have come out and celebrated what our veterans have done in our country. In the control room, Maya Hudgens, Fox 14 News.